Hi, I'm Nick from Cannawell, coming at you from our office in Vaughan, Ontario today. Uh, as you can see, I'm playing around doing some TIG welds with our uh, TIG P201DC. So this is a 200 amp pulse machine, uh, pulse TIG welding machine that's also a stick welder. So I know I've featured it in some of our videos before, but today I kind of wanted to show you guys a specific scenario where I think that our machines really excel, and I'm using this particular model to show it off. So like I said, I've been playing around uh, doing some TIG welding on some mild steel, and I'm going to pretend that I just ran out of gas. So that's a real pain. I got no argon gas left, but uh, what I do need to do is finish up doing some welding. And maybe I got a grinder nearby so I don't have to worry. So let's show you guys how quick and easy it is to switch this thing over into uh, stick welding mode. So first we'll unplug our gas. Take our tip torch out. Get this TIG torch out of the way. Let's switch our ground over to the negative. Let's grab our trusty arc welding electrode holder. Put that in the positive. Now, this button here, top is TIG pulse, middle is straight TIG, which is what I was doing. Let's switch that into stick. I'm going to break out some heavier plate. So let's crank the amps a little bit. And let's see if I'm actually ready to arc weld. That's it. That's how quick and easy it is to switch from one process to another. So let's see how this thing goes. Probably help if I put the ground on. So my voltage is up a little bit, definitely a little bit too hot, but it is for sure welding. And that is how simple and quick it can be to switch from doing TIG over to uh, stick welding using these machines. I mean, there's really not much to it. If you can follow the push button menu and you have your stuff available, in a pinch, I mean, if you're TIG welding away, you run out of gas, you can switch over, turn down your machine, stick weld it, right? And then uh, use your grinder to clean it up. Uh, so that it's, you know, beautiful, right? Because that's the whole point. That's probably why you were running a TIG welder in the first place. So uh, that pretty much wraps it up for this video. If you guys have any questions about this machine or any of our other machines, go ahead and leave those in the comment section down below. We'd like to use that to drive our content later on. And if you're tech savvy, you can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And so until I see you guys next week with an actually really interesting video that's going to reference our Fabtech show in Chicago, stay safe out there, guys. Keep having a lot of fun. Thanks.